Maximilius, the toxic YouTuber that has harassed many. Maximilius, the YouTuber that had his brainwashed fans go to my Discord and threaten to DDoS me if I didn't take down my video on him. Maximilius, the guy that's been exposed by some ordinary gamers, Penguin Z, and myself. He is officially terminated. Let's celebrate. Though that's besides the point, let's get straight into why he got terminated and why I actually think he got terminated or he even just deleted his channel. Also, before we get into the video, thank you to all the people that subscribed to my channel for my last video. It means so much. It really does help. If you search up Maximilian Muss on YouTube, you won't find him, but just fanboys that have the profile picture, which was back from 2017. And if you didn't watch my last video, I really recommend you watch it before you watch this one as I cover why I thought he should be terminated in my last video and I guess my wishes came true because he's officially off YouTube and a lot of people are causing hell because of it. For those that have watched my last video, you know all the bad things Maximilian Musk did, and honestly, I think he deserved to be terminated. There were some disputes in my comment section about him not distributing, you know, CP, if you know what that is. You know, it's about Pokemon Go, the CP. You know exactly what that is. If you don't, you're innocent. Get off YouTube. Uh, but basically, that could have been proven false, but everything else he did was pretty toxic. Sending his toxicators to people's, you know, streams, making people, you know, eat their own poop. That was the worst case I've ever seen. And the thing that really had me thinking was, I went to Maximilian Musk's channel after after, you know, some ordinary gamers upload a video on him. And I looked at the comment section and it was filled with K dollar sign S, which is totally counterintuitive of what some ordinary gamers, Penguin Z, Zero, and I even wanted in the first place. Because what we wanted was him to just explain his actions, which he did on his second channel, which I'll cover in my video, this one. But there were people, fans of me, I don't know, Penguin Z, some ordinary gamers, Mudahar, they were going to his channel and saying for him to, you know, off himself. And that itself is messed up. The stuff he did was beyond messed up also, but that is just worse. What you should do is leave a report and leave and the reports either got to YouTube or Maximilian Musk just said I'm done with all this hate. What I found hilarious like I mentioned some of his fanboys came to my discord and was like Maximilian Musk is a genius. He's so smart. He does all this stuff genius. He's getting the hate because he wants it. This is him just being smart. And I said this hate is not smart. This is not anything someone would wish on themselves. This is career ending. And their response was like no he knows what he's doing. You're a small YouTuber. You don't know what you're doing. And these are the same people that threatened to DDoS me and they posted gore in my you know chat because they thought that was funny. And that's what Maximilian Musk's fan base was, and that's why I thought he should be terminated. His entire fan base was awful. However, there was a rain of sunshine. As I looked through my comments section, there were people with Maximilian Musk's profile picture and saying, man, I really shouldn't have supported this dude. I feel bad. And there were other people saying, damn, I'm not going to support this guy anymore. And that actually makes me happy because there's a difference between not supporting someone and saying for him to off himself because the second one's just messed up regardless. As of now, there's not really anything we can do but speculate why Maximilian Musk deleted his channel, but there is things we can go over. Uh, possibly his second channel still up. I'm gonna check that now. I can't seem to find his second channel, but we're gonna be reviewing the Maximilian Musk deleted response to Penguin Zero from second channel, and I'm gonna give my hot take on it because, hell, I gave a hot take my last- hell, why'd I say that? Hell, I gave a la hot take my last video, and it got 83 Maximilian Musk stands, you know, hating on me. And I was totally okay with that because there were 800 common sense people that were like, damn, you have a point. And with this, I don't know, we'll just see what Maximilian Musk's points could have been because he honestly could have refuted these on his main channel and been fine if the response was good, if at all. There's almost nothing more embarrassing than actually watching Maximilian Musk. That's like standing up and declaring yourself a p***, you know? That's wild. Is there any level of shame? So Critical just decided to call 1.5 million people p***. Funniest thing is, Maximilian Muffs lost like 300,000 subscribers or something totally ridiculous from this drama. So 1.5, let's tone that down to 1.3. Hell, zero now. Why he's done this? What caused this? Oh my god, look at these people sending messages in this chat and they're saying, oh yeah, yeah? Oh, they really are p Okay, what Critical does next is a 5 million IQ move. Let's see and I'm gonna react live. Remember when he took over YouTube for a bit? Yeah, and then he started sharing child porn in his Discord. It's been all downhill since then. Oh, okay, alright, let's... So, I shared child porn in my Discord. Now, let's see the evidence that he presents next after making such a bold statement. Thing is, people were debating the CP argument, and I understand their debate. I even said, hell, even if he didn't distribute that, which I know, that's a felony crime, that's awful. I said that was awful, I probably shouldn't have accused it as hard as I did, but there was a chance, especially since I said I trust Critical, I really do. There's a reason this dude's off the internet now, he was in the wrong. The top comment is, in quotes, he called me a pile. he's not wrong, but he has no evidence from Maximilian Musk, and if that doesn't prove, you know, you are not innocent, dude, for at least half of the stuff you did, then I don't know what will. I think I just take. Oh. Oh, you're talking about chess now. He's so retarded. Why would you 
He's look. What are you talking about? That clearly was the best move. Even though the knight on c6 could take the pawn, it's still a worthy trade, as it's just a you know a pawn for a pawn. There's nothing more to it. I don't care if a random person calls me a pedo, because I know people would be. But this man is supposed to be the voice of reason. He's got seven million subscribers, and he's literally in front of five thousand people saying like, "Oh yeah, this guy shares child in his Discord." Oh um, <clears throat> evidence. It. No, I don't happen to have any. Why? What? You saw him in the chat? You. And all of this pretty much happened because I was in my Discord and we were going to random streams and just saying, oh yeah, yeah. And now I do agree that, like, going to streams is spamming, it's not mature. And I think it's pretty easy to understand that. He could call me cringe, he could call me embarrassing, unfunny, uncreative, he could call me so much stuff. But to literally do that when you're a 7 million fucking subscriber channel it's just it's honestly just sad it's really sad i'm surprised as well nico that wasn't an exaggeration his discord literally shares child porn with each other as jokes like it's fucking wild all right let's see the monsters in action where they're sharing child porn with each other as a joke critical called you a pedophile what do you have to say for yourself well it is kind of true so i can't really say anything about that <laughs> so uh Okay, like I said, this is a worn argument. I mean, they're still raising you to delay your channel, and it's not just because people accuse you of doing the CP, it's because you're a toxic individual and someone that really I despise. The thing you did with that, you know, I don't know if I covered this in my video, you know, making a special needs person eat his own poop, dude. Even though, and your only argument against you doing that was, oh, Critical said I did on stream. It was only in a Discord call. I only made him eat his own poop in a Discord. Like, dude, does that make it any better? Does that make it any less of a f up situation no no it absolutely doesn't and that's basically his little argument against the video he says that you know him being toxic edgy that's totally true but him sharing cp is not and i can agree with that sure you sharing cp is not but the bottom line is you are toxic as hell and you are off the internet now because of your actions it's not leafy toxic i made the comparison leafy toxic is his 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 fans go after you i'm not saying leafy fans are brain dead i was once one of them but maximilius stands or some di something different dude like they came to my discord a whole mob of them they went my vc and then I had my friend join the VC without them knowing. And it was like a bunch of squeakers like, Dude, Maximilian Mist is genius! And no, no, he's absolutely not. And he's off the internet now because of his genius capabilities. No, he's absolutely not genius. So yeah, that's gonna wrap up the Maximilian Mist saga on my, you know, entire YouTube. Thank you all so much for the recent support. It really revived my channel. And now I have 2.7 thousand subscribers and I couldn't be more thankful. If you enjoyed this video, please go watch the video I'm gonna show on screen in a bit. As I work hard on all my videos, I mean, just because I talked about Maximilian Mist doesn't mean that's what I'm gonna be doing for the rest of my career i'm also gonna be covering other you know bad youtubers other edgy subjects so if you want to subscribe please do so also my discord is in the description if you want to join into bay or join and mob one of my vcs and you know argue max a million months because those people it's kind of funny i hope you have a blessed day go do something productive and i'll see you on the next one peace